Hi, dear all. Good morning. Today, I am going to discuss how to make this type of customized table in Stata. Generally, we need to make this type of table manually after analyzing data using Stata or SPSS, but we need huge amount of time. But if we use Stata 18 D table command, then this type of table will be generated. Let's discuss practically. This is eight, Stata 18 version. So uh, without 18 version, it's not possible to make this type of table using customized command. So now I would request you to download the example data from the video link, video description. Please click the link, then data will be downloaded. So I kept the data in my D drive ABC folder. So click open and go to D drive, click ABC folder, and there is a data, my data. If you click the link in the description, video description, then this data will be downloaded. So click here, open. Yeah, yes, this is our example data. So generally in the previous version, we summarize the category variable by other category variable like this. Sorry, like this. Or just for continuous variable, we use some. But today, our objective is to create a table, automatically table, using detect command. So, so first go to statistic, then summary, then table of desktop statistics. If we click here. Then we'll get in the windows. Now we have to select some variable which will be created table. So first, for example, this is S, this is division, weight index, sex, height, weight, etc. So we have to define which is category or which are continuous. For example, this is S, S continuous. This is division, division is category. If a variable will be category, then we have to type I dot. This is also category I dot. This is six, category I dot. This is continuous, this is continuous. BMI cat, it is continuous type of toilet, it is also continuous, education, continuous, sorry, category, sorry, sorry, category. Category, category, this is continuous, this category. If there is the, the we have to type I dot for category variable, however, for continuous variable, we need not to I dot. Now, we would like to summarize the table by a group variable, for example, place of residence. If we submit, yes, now the table has been generated. There is a problem is decimal point. Please see that this is decimal two, but is decimal one, but would like to make same point. For example, two decimal point or one decimal point. So we have to format, just click format, create, okay. Then our interested to assess two decimal point, two decimal point, and which is statistic? One is mean, 
uh, standard deviation and factor percentage, factor percentage. Yes, factor variable percentage. Okay, accept. So, submit. Sorry, we have to select. We have to select fixed numeric. That means if we have to type fixed numeric and mean HD a percentage. Now we have to select and submit. Okay. Now all are two decimal point. Now we need to. We need to show the test across group so show just we have to show then p value will be displayed yes this p value so pearson chi square has been used for category variable regression means t test this test has been used for continuous variable now we like to export, export, just export. Yes, obviously do, do, doc file, then export into, sorry, ABC folder. Just we like to export D drive, ABC folder, or any other folder. Table two, just table two. Sir, if we submit or okay, no problem. Okay, that, that means under the D type in ABC folder, a table has been generated. The name of table is table two. Go to the table two, D drive. ABC table two. Just type table two. Yes, <laughs> the table has been generated. So we can. Remove the symbol percentage. So please, control A's, control A's, and type percentage, percentage, and replace blank. So if we click replace all, then percentage symbol will be removed. So, but for Continuous variable, this is mean and SD, we have to mention. First, we have to tap indicators in percentage. And for this variable, we just, we can use footnote. We can use footnote. We can use footnote. Footnote for continuous variable. This is also continuous variable. This is continuous variable. Sorry. Footnote. This is continuous variable. This is continuous variable. And this is continuous variable. Mean SD. Mean SD.
we can we can remove this row and we can make another column in the left side so click layout then insert left so mars mars also the, the, just uh, variable for the variable name we can mars 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 Mouse. Okay. Just I'm formatting. This P value. Okay. So yes this is our final table so if the number of variable will be large then we need the same time and this is our main command i will i will provide the command in my first comment thank you